we take a look at the roads, you can see the usual rush hour traffic on the A13, that's through Dagenham as you head into London. In Battersea, Prince of Wales Drive is closed for gas works and there's only one Woolwich ferry running because of mechanical problems. It could be Thursday before it's back to a normal two-boat service. OK, time for a check now on the weather with Kate Kinsella. Good morning. Across some parts of London yesterday, the temperature rose to 18 Celsius. Very impressive for February. Not quite as warm today, but it is still mild, damp and cloudy. Some outbreaks of light rain and some drizzle. Quite a breezy day as well. Now, the temperature, it is still mild, between 13 and 15 Celsius, the maximum temperature, but it isn't going to feel quite as warm as yesterday. There's less in the way of sunshine. Now, we hang on to these breezy, rather dull conditions overnight. Low clouds, some murk some light rain and some drizzle throughout the course of the night. Quite a damp night on the whole and it stays breezy. The minimum temperature though barely dropping. Another mild night, 10, 11 Celsius. So staying in double figures leading to another mild start to Wednesday. Very similar conditions tomorrow. Lots of low cloud. We'll see some more rain, perhaps more in the way of rain through the course of Wednesday and a strengthening breeze. The maximum temperature again stays reasonably mild at 13 Celsius. For Thursday, a deep area of low pressure sweeps across the UK that's going to bring some very wet and very windy weather to all of us for Thursday. That'll clear away for Friday, leading to a better day. So for tomorrow, similar conditions for Thursday, very wet and very windy. Then things starting to cool off considerably as we head towards the end of the week. I'm back in half an hour with all the latest. Until then, you can get plenty more on our website. Time to hand you.